Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Now if you're new, welcome. We do movie and series reviews and monthly wrap up tier lists. So if any of that sounds interesting to you, consider hitting that subscribe button. I was actually reached out by the director of Cycles, Oscar Wynnum Hyde. So sorry if I mispronounced your name. If I recall correctly, this is Oscar's um, directorial debut and I think everybody involved in the movie except for a producer or somebody that was involved in the movie has done other things. So it's really, really neat that this is, again, like something that's new for everybody. An apprehensive young man moves into university halls and the sudden feeling of isolation forces him into an argument with his older brother about identity, love, and the true representation of dreams. This is something that will be available on Amazon Prime February the 28th. First off, the cinematography at the opening part of the movie is actually really nice. We get some nice little shots, some nice little music going on, and then we kind of get into the dorm room in this university. The older brother is um, dropping off the younger uh, brother, um, you know, to start off this new chapter in his life. Now, because it is in one particular room, for the majority of the of the movie, I think there's like maybe a scene or so that we are like in the hallway and in a bathroom, but for the majority of the movie, we are in um, the younger brother's dorm room. Now, when you are stuck in like one location, in this case, the dorm room, and you only do have, you know, two actors, it could get pretty tricky uh, just because there's not too much going on. When it does come to um, the script, it is a pretty good script. So these two actors did do a very good job. I personally feel the stronger one of the two brothers was the younger brother. He, to me, was for sure the standout here. The older brother still did a really good job. The reason that the film was pretty good, I felt like it did, um, for the most part, move along. Um, the movie isn't long at all. It's a little over an hour long, like an hour five, hour seven and it did give me that hour feel to it it wasn't a movie that just felt super quick and it wasn't rushed so it did have a uh, really good pacing now i don't have like too many negatives some of the audio when we were in those dead silent moments you could definitely tell when they uh put the volume down uh just to not have like just like the dead air noise so that was probably like one of my biggest deals also some of the edits that were involved i just i really wasn't here for um just a couple of them it is again a very dialogue heavy movie of course because we are just within these two characters so we do um, go through a lot of emotions, a lot of ups and downs. The um, the younger brother, of course, is the one that ha is going through all of these emotions. And the older brothers, they're listening and trying to, like, calm him down and give him, like, reasoning and be that older brother. I definitely have to give kudos um, to the director for, you know, this being first time a movie you know something that you wrote and directed and did everything for and then just the mere fact that you were able to get this onto amazon prime now i'm not gonna lie to you guys because i already know i'm not gonna lie to you i don't really know who i would recommend this movie to i really really don't are definitely somebody who wants to give the underdog an opportunity i say check out cycles it is um gonna be on amazon prime give them the uh, support that they need to continue to grow and continue to make more movies that you know are just gonna get like greater and greater because again it is a first time film and it they did do a really good job because it definitely could have been an absolute disaster and trust me i would not be here upping a movie or talking positives about a movie when it was like bad <laughs> <laughs> like I would never do that to you guys I would never put you guys through a bad bad movie uh, but yeah again um, I just know that a lot of people don't like um, dialogue filled uh, movies and this is definitely that lots of emotions going on here but again if you are somebody who likes to give the underdog um you know a shot and are like you know what screw these big production movies if you've seen cycles let me know down below what did you think about it did you like it did you love it did you hate it was it just not for you of course if you haven't already don't forget to give this video a like subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time that I post something new until next time I'll see you guys at concessions bye Thank you.